This is my apartment. That's the send at the police. I'm putting together a care package for my nieces. They live in California. I live in Chicago. And so I'm like, I should make them something and give them things. And I macro made this necklace. It started out as a bracelet and quickly it finished as a necklace. And then this one I made as well. So, I feel like it's a wonderful little treat for them and me both to get to, I don't know, put my time and effort into something and to, to offer them. I don't know, as, as a remembrance of Uncle Dave. This is hemp thread, uh, hemp cord that I got <clears throat> from, I don't know, Joanne's. I've had it for like two years, so and it was like $4 each, $8. I've made some other things. I've, so then I also did this one as a bracelet that eventually broke from wear and tear because I was wearing it. Uh, this is Tiger's Eye. This was uh, three different cords. The purple, the pink, the blue. No, not the blue, it has the, the light purple, the lavender, the dark purple, a pink, a burgundy, and a gray. This is another one. This was four different cords. Brown, blue, burgundy, purple. Um, oh, I guess I got gray. I'm going to make a necklace <laughs> from my sister. And I'm gonna use this as the color scheme because I think I have just about those colors on here with the addition of probably the purple, or not, not the purple, the uh, maroon, burgundy, luscious red. I'm gonna do, say, three lengths. One, two, three, let's do four. I'm gonna do four lengths. Look at my handy dandy sewing kit. Separate the colors apart. You want to do a knot. Um, and then just keep making it. So you got that going on. And then you want to do the same thing the other side. I'm going to switch the color that I use. I'm going to use the brown one now as my knotter, my knot T, <laughs> my knotting of, 
I'm just gonna make more knots. these two together you want to introduce another set of string and then kind of like a braid you're gonna bring them in here Made, then it's braided and now we have a knot with this knot now we're gonna do some more of the same braiding and I'm gonna mix up the colors so now I have pink and green and then brown and blue and brown oh pink and purple wait pink lavender lavender brown green um, pink yeah I'm gonna use the pink one because it's longer and I don't have very much of it up there up top so I'm going to use the pink to do the knotting with
do it. And then I'm going to separate the strands. I'm going to send them through this loop. Artistic macrame pendant that only requires a second strand or a final strand of hemp cord. Gonna wrap it around everything and also myself. So you have that. And pull it. And now we're just gonna do those knots again. And I'm giving my nieces these cookies from a show I did uh, called Fantasy Foods. It was a pilot by Get Like Your Productions. So yeah, I think they like those. It's a little memorabilia. And then my sister has a thing for dragonflies. And they're just some matches. She and I both have a habit that requires um, fire. I remember as a kid getting packages from my aunt around Christmas time. Uh, she would send cookies and gifts. I was always neat to get something homemade. I really appreciated that growing up. It was just, I don't know, what a treat. Someone put effort and thought into a gift. I'm off to the post office. Thank you for visiting my apartment. I'm David Carter, and this has been Designing David. <laughs>